What's going on everyone? My name's Roscoe and welcome to the channel. So we have a big update on the Yeezy 700 V3. One is that we can expect it to be dropping in 2019. Now that caught me by surprise when I heard this. I was expecting the shoe to be dropping in 2020. Well, it looks like there is a release date right now. It's not fully set, probably to be dropping on December 20th. Now that's just a placeholder. I wouldn't be surprised if the shoe got pushed back into 2020. I do find quite strange because if you look it up on the calendar, December 20th is a Wednesday. Not very often we see Yeezys drop in the middle of the week. Another thing that was announced is that we can expect this shoe to have a retail price of $180. $180. We've been asking for Yeezys to come down a little bit. The prices have just been going up and up and up. I mean, who can afford, you know, buying all these colorways in the 700 when it's $300, $300, $300. It's too much. So it's good to see that they brought it down a little bit, but are losing a little bit of some features. One, being boost. There will be no boost on the upcoming 700 V3. Ye tested out some samples with boost, but he decided to take the boost out and now they're going with this new sort of technology in the sole. I don't know the name of it just yet. I've heard it's not Adi Prime, it's just a total whole new technology. I wouldn't worry about the comfort on this shoe at all. They're not gonna put out something super uncomfortable. A lot of you guys out there cop Jordan 1s on a reg, and Jordan 1s to me, I think it's one of the most uncomfortable sneakers, but they're super stylish, so I deal with it. Now the first colorway that's going to be releasing is Azil. I looked it up and it's Hebrew for made of God. How wild is that? The name of the shoe is basically Made of God. You know, they rock that fear of God. Well, we're gonna be out there rocking Made of God. I just found that kind of wild, but that's really, these names for these sneakers are really starting to get more Hebrew, got more gospel-like. I am all for it. I think it's unique. I think it's different. Now, what I love about the design on this 700 V3, one is that it has like this exoskeleton that's gonna wrap this shoe which I thought was kind of cool. It's gonna have some prime knit. So there's gonna be a prime knit design. It's gonna have this wave print on it. Uh, they're gonna be able to change that color of the prime knit on these upcoming colorways. So that will change, but this one, it just looks like it's gonna be tan and it's gonna be wrapped in this exoskeleton. It's gonna be translucent, so you're gonna see right through it. So you'll see the pattern on the side of the shoe. And then this exoskeleton will glow in the dark. I love glow in the dark on sneakers. So the sole does look a lot different from the regular 700s we see. There's no ovals on the side of this sole. However, on the back of the heel, it does have that curve up which is very familiar and it looks just like the Yeezy Boost 380s. It will be an Adidas logo on the back of the heel, which is different. We usually don't see the three stripes or the Adidas logos. And then I had to check if the shoe has 3M and it does in fact have some 3M. Not a lot, not what we're used to seeing on the Yeezy 700s. It's gonna be on the tongue. There's a little bit probably on the lace locking system and that's it. Now the bottom is the same as the 700s, except they just updated it. Now there's gonna be like 10 preparation holes. I'm super excited. I Hopefully it drops on December 20th. I think we're all gonna be hoping for that. I know it's super early, but at that price point of $180, everyone's gonna be going for it. At $180, there's a lot of room to play with. I definitely expect this to have some good high resale value. I can see this shoe going for like, you know, 375, possibly 450. But guys, let me know down in the comments what you think of the new upcoming Yeezy 700 V3. As real? No, it's as real. There you go. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and smash that like button for me and subscribe to the channel. And like always, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.